divisibility rules. Objectives. In this session, you will be learning divisibility rules of 2 and 3, divisibility rules of 4, 5 and 6, divisibility rules of 8, 9 and 10, and divisibility rules of 11 and 12. Divisibility rules of 2 and 3. The divisibility rule of 2 is that the number should have 0, 2, 4, 6 or 8 at the end. The divisibility rule of 3 is that the sum of all the digits should be divisible by 3. For example, 3942. The sum of 3 plus 9 plus 4 plus 2 is equal to 18. And 3 6 are 18. So the number 3942 is divisible by 3. Divisibility rules of 4, 5 and 6. The divisibility rule of 4 says that the last two digits should be multiple of 4. For example, the number 420. Here, the last two digits are 20. And 4 fives are 20. So, the number 420 is divisible by 4. The divisibility rule of 5 says that the last digit must be 0 of 5. For example, the number 695. Here, the last digit is 5. So, the number 695 is divisible by 5. The divisibility rule of 6 says that the number must be divisible by 2 and 3. For example, the number 372. First, we will check its divisibility by 2. The last digit is 2. So, the number 372 is divisible by 2. Now, we will check its divisibility by 3. The sum of 3 plus 7 plus 2 is 12 and 3 into 4 is 12. So the number 372 is divisible by 3. The number 372 is divisible by both 2 and 3. So it is divisible by 6. Divisibility rules of 8, 9 and 10. The divisibility rule of 8 says that the last three digits should be divisible by 8. For example, the number 9112. The last three digits are 112. So, when we divide 112 by 8, we get remainder as 0. Hence, the number 9112 is divisible by 8. The divisibility rule of 9 says that the sum of all the digits should be divisible by 9. For example, the number 234. So, here the sum of 2 plus 3 plus 4 is 9 and 9 ones are 9 so the number 234 is divisible by 9 the divisibility rule of 10 says that the last digit should be 0 for example the number 400 here the last digit is 0 so the number 400 is divisible by 10. 
Divisibility rules of 11 and 12. The divisibility rule of 11 says that the difference of the sums of the alternate digit is either 0 or a multiple of 11. For example, the number 9746. So, in the number 9746, we had to add 9 and 4 and 7 and 6. So, 9 and 4 will give us 30. Also, 7 plus 6 will give us 13. And 13 minus 13 is 0. So, the number 9746 is divisible by 11. The divisibility rule of 12 says that the number should be divisible by both 3 and 4. For example, the number 720. So first, we have to check its divisibility by 3. The sum of 7 plus 2 plus 0 is 9. And 3 multiplied by 3 is 9. So the number 720 is divisible by 3. Now we will check its divisibility by 4. The last two digits are 20. And 4 times 5 is 20. So the number 720 is divisible by 4. The number 720 is divisible by both 3 and 4. So it is divisible by 12. It seems that now you will be able to check the divisibility of these numbers. Please like and share my video. Also, subscribe my channel for more updates. Thank you.